start bad, man. Hold on, I'm live when I start bad. I can't see myself. But anyway, I'm live on YouTube is fucking up. That's YouTube. That's Facebook. Hello. Oh, what am I doing here? Being stupid again, playing stupid again. Uh, I know what I'm doing. I'm gonna start cooking. That's exactly what the fucking thing right here. Cooking. Uh, when I say cooking, it's gonna be funny because I said I'm gonna start doing all these cooking videos and I'm going on a trip. I'm going on a trip very fucking soon, like today. Going to New York and I have to cook all the food in the fridge and all the food in the fridge is vegan. I'm gonna cook a uh, vegan because I'm hanging out with this girl and she's vegan and that's not the reason. I just have vegetables and other things. So basically the whole cooking is gonna be about vegetables and uh, I can't be on Facebook so whatever text I can't see it. I'm gonna play stupid. On my YouTube I can see myself. That's good. I hope the sound is good. I don't know what's going on. I don't care uh, because I'm gonna be cooking but I need a beer first. I don't need a beer, this is not advertising, this is my beer. And um, I'm gonna need a smoke while I start. Actually, no, I'm gonna need a fucking coffee. So basically, the whole cooking starts with make yourself a coffee, motherfucker. I don't know if I can curse or not, man. I think cursing is part of the language that uh, we try to annihilate only because we society tells so. But every motherfucker out there curse. Uh, uh, saying about that, fuck yeah, coffee time. So saying about that, every motherfucker out there curse is because that's who we are. People that don't curse, I don't fucking trust them. Why? Because they shady fuckers. When I say shady fuckers is because they fucking fake, man. They try to pretend who they are not. They try to pretend, pretend that they're, oh, they're better educated. Go fuck yourself. Uh, not all of the people that don't curse. Listen, everybody curse. That's part of a fucking dictionary vocabulary. Otherwise, it wouldn't exist. We don't just make up words. We emphasize words with cursing. Yeah, it's a cooking video, right? Mm-hmm. It's a fucking cooking video. I need to put my glasses on because I'm looking at one camera, then the other camera, and then it's two, so I have to look in the middle to look, I don't know, and then be like, this. But that's all said. I try to be cool as, as well. This is better on blind now, playing uh, Stevie Wonder on the thing. What else? Oh, by the way, uh, I moved to Miami. Probably everybody knows, and probably nobody gives a fuck. But that's how it is, so I moved to Miami, life is good, I got myself a yacht, so that's even better. Uh, it's a mini yacht, it's a stingray, nobody... I don't know shit about that one, I can't even start it, I can't even do nothing about it. But I'm spending time there and I love every second of it. All set, uh, I need to make coffee, then I'm gonna start doing the cooking, which cooking is always the best way to be an artist, I think. Cooking is part of a, it's an art form. I mean, not an art form in a way that uh, they try to pretend that, look what I did. No, motherfucker, just play with flavors and with the shit you have in the kitchen. Uh, now I have two spoons. One goes on. Okay, beer time and then we start. It's going to be a very boring process, it's going to be a lot of stupid shit talking. I can't see, I need another tablet, I'm recording something, where is that thing? I'm recording something, I can't see, everything is booked, I have that one, that one. I live on, be on Facebook, I, I don't know what I can Oh, I can see it! Alright, cool, perfect. I can see it, I can see who's watching me, that's even better. Okay. I have a nice delay there, so probably if I can beep myself at the time, I shouldn't have beeped myself, but beep, beep, oh, what's good. Cheers, mofos. Ah, come on. I can't, I can't, I can't. People are calling me while I'm doing. Well, anyway, so, 
It's about cooking. What are you gonna cook today? Let me bring the cameras uh, that way. Uh, right here. <laughs> I don't have my stuff. I pretty much I have an empty. Not now. Pretty much I have an empty plastic cup. But as I said, I have to. I have to clean up my fridge. Uh, when I said I have to clean up my fridge, uh, come your camera here. <laughs> fucking pigs in the house. Yeah, nobody burps. I know we live in a society where people don't burp. Get the fuck out, man. Uh, at least I don't fart while I'm cooking. But, so have uh, green beans, all those mushrooms, potatoes, some lemon asparagus, asparagus, Ah, uh, that's not even good. That's the end of it. I cooked the rest on the boat. I don't, I don't my, I don't my cooking video on the boat. No, no, I didn't post it up. I do some YouTube videos. Cream cheese, that's good. A lost potato, lost in the sun. Oh, what the fuck is this? Celery, all right, that's good. Spinach, that's good. Carrot, that's good. One half lonely tomato, that's good. Uh, some pasta sauce, that's good. Uh, I think I should have something else on my fridge. Sorry people, don't bump into me. I got some very old cilantro, that's good. Okay, I got that's gonna go on the bean because he's dead. I got onion. That's actually really tasty. I have more onions. I gonna need about two or three onions. Hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I need to get my sound here. So this is my sound here. One of them has a mic sound. The YouTube has a mic sound. But I need more tomatoes. I have onions. Okay, so this is what I'm gonna cook with. This is for juice. This is what I have, this is what we deal with, and it's gonna be phenomenal. It's gonna be tasty, and when I'm saying about vegan, I'm not joking, man. I'm gonna have this one as a substitute for meat. I tasted the other day, I cooked something with it. Uh, it's shit. That's the fucking truth, man. It's very hard to compensate the flavors like a real meat has. But I can cook nice with it because I'm the motherfucking chef in the house. And that's what's important today. Alright, so. We're gonna start. Numero uno. Numero uno. We go back here again. I have two cameras, man. Like all of you can see, I have two cameras. Uh, I'm moving shit around like I'm a ninja. One day I'm gonna get one of those ports and I can start spinning and like drag the camera and uh, Rock for two weeks! Uh, what's the name? The Rock to the Rambo! No, I don't even know what the fuck name of that stuff. But, let me move the camera so everybody can see the way I cut stuff. Uh, so this is my kitchen, that's cooking. This is my new place, by the way, and it's phenomenal! I'm working on the new painting right there. It's a little bit mess in the house. Already I made a fucking mess with the paints all over the place. I got a brand new cut to that one, and then the first day I open it, I cut it. Welcome to my world. This is my first beer for today, so I'm not drunk yet. I will be later. And if it's kids watching this channel, don't fucking do it. Go back to sleep or go do your homework. Because this is not for kids. So, we start. Rule number one, we're gonna do the onions. We're gonna get a nice uh, flavor. Bam, 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 bam. Man, having these glasses on, it's I'm half blind, but what happens when I look at the cameras, none of you watch which one I'm looking because actually I have two cameras. 
Dva kameras, dva kameras, dva kameras. So this is Facebook, it's three people watching, amazing. And this is YouTube, five people watching, even better. Salutări de la Dublin, Mihai, merci, ok. So, the fuck, that one is hot. Ok, cool. We do the audio stuff here with the... With my YouTube, I can zoom in, believe me or not. Uh, the GoPro, I can come closer, believe me or not, and make it the way it should be. Just like that, I suppose. Is that good? I hope so. Anyway, let me take my glasses off. I gotta cut my fingers off, man. You gotta have a drink. Damn fucking right, brother. Yo, yo, of course they're gonna have a fucking drink. So, I took my glasses off because I'm a little bit half blind. Let me put some light in here. Sorry about all this mess, but it has to be done. I'm here to do it. Who is gonna do it? Alright. Whoa, I got blinded now. Yo, hold on a second. That's not even that cool. That's funny. Oh, that's funny. Alright, better. Back to the business. Back to the business, guys. Back to the business. Cutting onion is really, really important. Why? Because... Now, this one is gonna be... So, this onion, basically... Tony, ce faci Tony? Bă, Tony, bă, am văzut că mai sunat, dar... Îți spă live aici și n-am cum să răspund. Uh, yeah, that's my Romanian with my amazing good friend Tony from Dublin. Salutar Tony! So, this is the onion. By the way, onion is good, man. So what I'm gonna do with this onion, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I don't even know the English word, man. I'm just gonna, burn it a little bit, whatever, to give it some flavor. Then I'm gonna put the... Uh, I'm gonna put the... Uh, let me get my bean here. Then... Uh-huh, uh-huh. So, then I'm gonna put the the beans, because they take a while to cook, so they're gonna be the thing. But... It's so fucking simple, right? So the onions is the first step. And some garlic. I took all this nice, like big, because pretty much it's gonna melt by the time I finish. I'm talking about my cooking videos. Uh, okay, talking about my cooking videos, it's really important because I want to do something more than coffee is done. I want to do something more than just do videos, and it's fun. And I start doing a lot of vlogging on YouTube, which they're pretty stupid. Most of it is about talking shit about myself and with myself. Cool. Let's get this ready. I got this one right here. So this is the onions. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. This is gonna be vegan. By the way. For all the vegan people out there, this is vegan, so that's the way I do things. I don't even know. Che pas matro, tikle. So I don't even know how this time is gonna come up, but it's good. So yeah, when I cook, I can cook vegan too. Don't worry about it. I'm good at it. So that's done. Let's get the fry pan out. Fry pan is on point. We're gonna cook it right here. Everybody can see where he went. He went on the spot. Cool, that's done. I need my coffee. I'm like a motherfucking ninja in this house. Uh, when I'm sound like a ninja is because, oh, 
My YouTube channel is Ninja CG. I changed like a few times. I'm like like fucking Lil Wayne, whatever the fuck his name is, or uh, not like Lil Wayne, like uh, uh, Snoop Dogg. That one is Lion. One day is Snoop Dogg. One is Lion. One is the King. One is I don't know whatever the fuck they are. Every time is something. Now the beauty about this one cooking is. We're gonna use some hot and spicy garlic sauce. Because it's pretty fucking nice and tasty. Bă, Gabo, stai că te sticule, pe aia că dacă îți live cum să te ăsta, stai că vorbim, după ce termin te sun, te sun, te sun. There you go, some oil, because I like it. I was thinking, după ce, după, după ce termin te sun. So I'm talking now my friend from Ireland, Romanian. So this is a bilingual channel. Oh, and some avocado oil. That's probably used for... Um, that's probably... Hold on a second. That's probably... That's probably... Yo, I'm making some... With Tyrone, I'm making some vegan stuff, so that's probably for salad, but nobody cares. Uh, we're gonna do it right there, nice and... Let me put some light on, light on, light on, light on, light on. Cool! So, this is the two words I use. That's hot, that's hot, that's hot, that's hot. I'm playing like this is hot, this is hot, this is hot, this is hot, this is hot. Coffee is hot too. Ah, nice. Ah! The beer is cold. Cool. This is the only one we have now. I need garlic. So, first we do the onion, as I said, because it gives flavor. I burn it a little bit. And I'm gonna put some... Fuck, I don't even have paprika, man. I have hot, pe uh, hot paprika, cayenne. Ah, fuck, we're gonna make it spicy. May as well feel the feel it. Yo, Tony! Fuck my car, man! Chef Arch! Yeah, some of my friends think I'm crazy, which probably. Oh, uh, because I can't afford it. It's good to be crazy in a fucking stupid, crazy world. The world is crazy, may as well go with it. That's my point of saying things. So, this is the guy I'm gonna put in. This is the mess I'm gonna clean out. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Ah, uh, what are you gonna do with this? So this goes a little bit... Okay. I think it's cooked. I cut it big, only because by the time it's gonna be cooking, the, the, the piece, the, the green piece, they're gonna take about 40 minutes, half an hour, 40 minutes to cook. So by the time it's gonna be all this is gonna be melted anyway. Well done, Chris. So welcome to my cooking channel. I gonna do a lot of more videos, man. I gonna do a lot of more videos. On YouTube I posted up a how I grill on the boat. I have a smaller boat, so I put a grill on the boat and I make some amazing fucking fried chicken because I'm fucking good. Chani! Uh-huh, Otsui Kamarja. Okay, I'll take a magic thing with credit. Ooh, that's nice. That's fucking nice. The fire is on six. I don't even know what that means. It's just on six. I know it's on six, and that means it's on six. Okay, so. Cheva Chai, Tepu, Shiva Yubes. It seems that uh, I have a lot of people watching, pretty much. Three people on Facebook! Okay. Which is cool. I told you, this is a waste of time. I have nothing else to do. You know, if I can be here and do nothing, good. Otherwise, I don't even have music because I'm not allowed to have music. YouTube is gonna say, uh, Chris, we're gonna not like the way you do things. Alright, that's done. I have a nice arsenal of uh, stuff here. I'm gonna choose the best one. This is the best one. Alright. I think the fire, yeah, the fire is good. So that's done. And I have some coffee and garlic. 
that done, perfect. Let me clean this as well. And because I'm nice, I'm gonna put some white wine right now, right here. Perfect. And um, to don't make a big smell in the house, we're gonna use this one. Perfect. It's so simple. So this is done. This is for later. I need down for flavor later. Uh, okay. I need more beer and a cigarette. Cool. Uh, what I was saying about cursing. Yeah, people don't curse, man. This is pity, man. The society goes wimp and everybody is it's vulnerable in a way of saying that it's vulnerable. They all try to fucking blame something on somebody because they don't have the guts to just be who they are. Uh, that's about freedom. When I say about freedom, not freedom of revolutionary freedom, just fucking free motherfucker, man. This is the this is the society we live today when it's the most free ever. You can fucking do whatever you, we, you want. Most I'm talking about general thing as a humans. Hundred years ago, you weren't even didn't have the money. Either you're hungry, either you're starving, or basically you weren't allowed. To. Now, I mean, I'm coming from Romania, and we are fucking free, man. We are fucking free, and all of humans are free. Free to do whatever the fuck you want in this life, and if you can do whatever the fuck in this life, just fucking do it. Don't be a fucking little crying. You hurt me, that like, hurt my feelings. With what? Saying fucking this and fucking that. Yeah, I hurt your feelings. Thank you. How about? Don't fucking watch me, don't fucking say anything, and it's easier to lose friends. I remember the time when tattoos were a big issue, and then if you have tattoos that don't like you, or tattoos divided society, now it's cool, it's an advertising, it's who you wanna be, fuck that shit. Anyway, back to cooking. I love cooking, and I always did, and I always will, because since I was 14, oof, this is nice, this is nice, this is nice. Since I was 14, I was living by myself and all said I had to learn how to look after myself and cooking was one thing. I remember first time or first times I, I attempted to have a cooking session, I fucked up big time because I didn't have a clue how, when, how and timing. Timing is everything and cooking timing is everything. Timing is everything in cooking. If you put the right thing, right amount, best you can cook with everything generally, with everything, but timing is the thing. You can't put Something that gets very soft, very easy, you cannot put, and it takes, let's say, beans right now. It takes half an hour to cook, right? You cannot just put stuff, uh, the spinach, which it takes only 20 minutes, right? Oh, I have carrots, so I forgot about it. I'm gonna cook the carrots and the beans. Actually, carrots comes down. We see carrots is another thing to cook. Um, they are, uh, yeah, I thought they are organic. Now those days everything is organic, everything is cool. I remember the days when being organic was dirty, uh, people buy nice stuff from the nice shops because it's big, and now we go back to organic stuff. Personally, I don't believe it's fucking organic, not in America, and I tell you why, because everything is super fucking processed. Every, they put, when I say organic is, my grandmother, the ground when we had organic thing, we never even put any chemicals in the ground. Now that's organic, right? Now, over here, they say it's organic, but they still pull out of chemicals. How the fuck is that organic? That's not organic, motherfuckers. Organic is when you don't put nothing, man. You put cow shit to, to fertilize the, the, the ground. That's organic. Not when you put a ton of fucking chemicals because they want to have 20 productions. This shit is only one a year production not 20 in a year, how can a fig be organic? Or maybe I'm wrong, but nobody cares. Anyway, that's how we clean really, really fast. There you go. So talking about, uh, talking about, talking about, uh, 
been crazy. I know I do tattoos, man, and I love it, and I'm gonna do more tattoo videos. I took a month off. Oh shit, I need this one. I took a month off because I moved, and I don't like to really become a slave to the trade. Because after all, it's all a trade. And I'm having a fucking blast time of my life. I moved from New York. New York right now, I think it's snowing, it's cold, it's whatever. I don't miss it for one second. All said, I'm gonna go to New York tonight, tomorrow morning, to bring my stuff from there. Uh, I'm not looking forward to that call, but you know what? A man has to do what he has to do to prove it. I'm talking like I'm going to Himalaya or something. Jesus Christ, Chris, put your mind together. All right, so this is the carrot time, carrot time, carrot time. I'm gonna put them before while this one is cooking. Okay, one thing with me being a chef. I'm messy, man. I'm fucking messy, man. I love my mess. Oh, fuck. Let me see. This one, time. Oh, man, this is nice. Oh. See that white wine? It makes it really nice and stuff. It's soft. It makes it really... There you go. Here we go. Nice and easy. Sorry, that one is kind of a... Cooking, of course it's fucking cooking. Yeah, there you go. That one goes in there, carrot. So far we have uh, onion, garlic, carrot, wine, white wine. The brown doesn't matter. I'm gonna put salt, pepper, and I'm gonna prepare the other stuff. Cool. And I'm gonna wash my hands. So, let me tell you this story in between. Yesterday I was on a boat, I was on my boat actually, so I was uh, fishing and I saw this blue, from far away it would look very bright blue thing, I don't know what it was, right? And then I had my fishing rod, I pulled it apart and I grabbed, luckily I grabbed a little bit and it just wrapped around me. It was one of those uh, jellyfish, Jesus fucking Christ that thing, man. So I had to do an air kelly on my finger because you have to pee on your whatever uh, area. So I had to do an air kelly on my finger. But like a fucking idiot, I didn't wash my hand, so then I touched my pee pee, and I couldn't do an air kelly on my pee pee. But, so I suffered for about three, four hours. It was bad. Luckily I didn't touch it only a little bit. I posted the video up on YouTube, actually I'm uploading it right now. But I was stupid as fuck. Never, I will never touch anything from the ocean. I just move here. I don't know what the fuck is in that place, man. I'm touching shit. My dick is gonna fall off tomorrow, man. Talking about yeah. All right, kids, go to don't listen to my shit. So <laughs> this is true story. This is fucking true story. This is true story. I said. Map, map. Perfect. I'm moving cameras left and right. I'm like a motherfucking pro right here. Let me push this one a little bit. That's cool. They're all good. Cool. So that was my story from yesterday, was a stupid, uh, oh man, oof, that's cooking, that's my boy, the fire has to be, the fire has to be, I mean it's on 6 or 7, I don't know what that means, but I'm gonna put it a little bit higher, it feels right here, it feels on 7, it's gonna be amazing, perfect, uh, on YouTube I have three people watching me, on Facebook I have three people watching me, I'm doing amazing, six people from two, <laughs> I'm gonna talk some shit about my son now, he's gonna hate me for life, <laughs> so he was over, he'll stay with me in New York, ah oh, man, he's gonna hate me for this, please don't bother tell him what I'm telling, anyway, so he was staying with me in New York and one day he says, Dad, well, first of all, he does YouTube videos, so he made his new channel about, I was about, I don't even know what it was about the new channel, he has about seven of them. And he says, Dad, I have an idea. I was like, okay, tell me, I'm curious about your idea. I says, well, listen, I'm kind of thinking, uh, after I finish this year to drop school and become a blogger, and um, work hard, <laughs> work hard, work hard, and then I'm going to make money, and year after I'm going to go back to school. I was like, yo, little, little, little ninja. 
like you, you have seven followers, man. <laughs> one is me, one is your mother, one is your sister, one you follow yourself. What are you gonna do? I said, I tell you, your mother is gonna kill you, man. What, what, what's in your head? <laughs> I like his dreaming, though, man. I, I mean, listen, I wanna be a flower too, but I can't lose my job, and I'm still doing, and I have few. Tiku, my marriage, my man, I'm the look of my age. Anyway, that was a stupid story about my kid. I love my kids, man. And I really, really, really miss them. Pepper, salt, more salt. Garlic and onion. Um, I love this stuff. This stuff is nice. This stuff is nice. I love that stuff. All right, let's do this way. Hold on, this way. Salt. As a matter, you can put a lot because we're gonna put the rest after. Pepper. A lot of, lot of, lot of, lot of, lot of pepper. So basically they say the salt makes everything softer, the pepper makes it harder. And the pepper actually doubles the... If you put salt, the seven use pepper is doubles the amount of intensi intensify the flavor, the flavor double time, salt only a little bit, so... I like it. I like it. Cool. And I'm gonna put some of this bad boy too. There you go. Anyway. Oh man, that's looking good. That's very good. That's nice. Me talking about the stuff, I forgot about something. This stuff. This one has to be clean, man. When I, when I say clean, I'm talking about this shit, man. You have to rip up these parts, the end, because they get very... I say like this ones. They got nasty, so they have to be cleaned up. Um, I'm glad that fire is still fucking burning. Good, Chris. You're a bad cook. Ooh, this is looks phenomenal. This looks phenomenal. You see the goldy color? It got a nice goldy color. Who can see it? Who can see it? Who can see it? It got a nice goldy color, but the problem with the goldy color right now is that I don't have time. I was talking a lot of fucking shit and I didn't do my, um, I didn't do the, I, I forgot to clean them up, but it's happening right now because I'm like a ninja. Cool, there we go. Let's get in there. I need another pot. I need a lot of other stuff. And I get it because I have it. There you go. I got it because I have it. I'm gonna move this one out of the way a little bit. I'm gonna do this one low a little bit. So what happened is I was talking a lot of random stuff and I forgot actually the real deal. You have to clean them up. And that's how it works. Cool. So, what else, what else, what else, what else, what else? The music is missing and nobody cares. I wouldn't mind to put some music, but I'm gonna start singing myself. Uh, when I'm saying singing myself, I'm gonna make a mess of myself. But I'm not in Thailand. When I went to, when I was in Thailand, I got adopted by this family. And every night they'll do karaoke and they'll invite me to come and sing with them. Uh, after a while they realized that I don't sing and my nickname was Chris No Sing. Chris No Sing! That's what I used to say it all the time. I don't know if I'm fan of the accent because now we have another situation here. Absolutely nothing, that's the way they talk. Uh, actually they didn't speak much English and that was the best experience, one of the best experiences of my life, traveling. Because you go down with the real people, they have 
real problems and then how to smile, how to how to enjoy themselves and how to actually enjoy life man, enjoy life, you know. They adopted me in this community and it was phenomenal. I really appreciate that time with them and they really made kind of the best to show me the best of during Koh Samui, the best of Koh Samui, I spent time with them every day for two weeks. I would go and spend time with them and people would ask me, why do you come to Thailand? I was like, listen, motherfuckers, I don't come here for hookers, man. First of all, I don't do hookers. Second of all, I'm definitely not going to do them in Thailand because they may have a Mickey Mouse down there. Yeah. Mac, mac. And the other thing is, the other thing is, uh, you don't know, man. I heard a lot of stories, like friends have a friend in Thailand, like Chris, you know. They they claim you, you rape them, they steal your passport, when you, whatever you want to do, shit. Uh, that's a lot of stories, actually, if you check. Uh, they come in, the cops come in, and, you know, you have to pay a lot of money. And that, I mean, that's not the fucking reason, but I don't think so. I don't do hookers because I don't pay for it. Yeah. So, yeah, what else in time? So they teach me how to cook Thai as well, but... I don't think I don't even know that the, 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 the I don't even know what kind of uh, things they use there. So uh, I mean I love that food, but I don't have an idea. So uh, fucking great. They, they say the internet is slow. Man, we are fucking flying on Mars, man. Check this show. We are flying on Mars. We landing we landing on asteroids like million years away, and we have slow internet. Am I missing something in this universe, man? It's, it's, I mean, how the fuck you have slow internet when you can talk live from here to fucking Mars? You have a live video stream from here to fucking Mars, and you have slow internet. I can, if I have a longer arm, I can grab it. You have slow internet, and we fucking talk live on Mars. We have fucking video, like HD videos from Mars. Are you fucking kidding me, motherfucker? Live video HD from Mars and I can't even fucking stream on 300 fucking 60 DPI. Get the fuck out of my face, ninja. Yeah, that's you see, that's the fucking problem. That's the problem we live today, man. Uh, yeah, I guess to a point that, uh, anyway, cool. Enough with bitching and money. Ooh. Oh man, oh man. This is just hard. Now, what I'm saying happen is, you have to see, where is that thing? But the, inter the light is shit, it's golden! And I have to put down back higher. If it's too slow, it gets too soft, I wanna make them a little bit crunchy. Good. Okay, more beer. So, that's a big dilemma, right? You have a live transmission from Mars on HD and then you can broadcast some stupid shit right here. And my internet tells me you have to be in 360 DPI. But I'm paying, I mean, $70 a month. How much do you think it's, I mean, what's, 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 what's how that shit works? Man? I like the same thing. They say, oh, we start the beginning of the universe and you can't fucking tell me the weather tomorrow. I mean, I love it. I mean, listen, I love it. I mean, you don't even know the storm is coming tomorrow, but you know there's a fucking storm on Mars right now, and you're filming the light. Are you following me? That's how we are. And then we worry about what other people like, and then the society gets to a point what other people do, what other, get the fuck out, man. <coughs> people can do what the fuck. That's what I'm saying, man. We are the most free thing. I mean, we try to be enslaved mentally, and we actually are, man, most of us. And generally we are, and then most of us, and then we we get awakened, but talking about awakening, I like, I like that uh, Jim Carrey guy, man. He was fuck, man. And that's how society, well, I, we should be, care. we should be to a point that we should be the or our own boss or of our own soul and of our own uh, thoughts. You know, everything is prefabricated and we prefabricated, prefabricated shit. I had this, I had this, uh, I'm working on this video right now, I filmed it today, of talking about the vlogging, how 
My blogs are stupid. They're fucking lame. They're really bad. They're really bad edit. Probably I don't even edit them. But it's how everybody has an expectation of everything has to be so sharp, so clean, so this, so that, everything fake, perfect hair, perfect fucking shoes, perfect fucking background, perfect fucking weather, perfect fucking holiday. Get the fuck out, man. Get the fuck out, man. How? Where is the real shit? Why everybody wants to see that fucking fake shit all the time? What? 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 What we became, man? Like you know the duck, perfect duck face. Fucking take a snapshot. What is that? Anyway, enough with bitching, please. I love. You're losing your viewers. Woo! You're losing your viewers. You're losing viewers here, bro. Oh man, now we're talking. Now we're talking. So what I'm saying with now we're talking is we have this little bit of a burning stuff right here, right? Um, where am I? Where am I? Where am I? We have a little bit of burning and that gives a nice flavor. So that's we're talking about cooking. So when you get to the point right now. Right now, that's exactly the point when I'm gonna put some paprika. I'm gonna put some paprika. Unfortunately, the cayenne pepper is not really the. It's not really the. I'm mean, still gives a little bit of flavor, so I'm gonna go very mild on it. Because I have a trip to do in a car, and you know how it gets. It gets squashy. <laughs> So that's burning. So now because that one's burning, now we put this one right here, right now. Drop it like it's hot. I'm gonna, what I'm gonna do with it, I'm just gonna let it burn just a little bit to get that the, the flavor. So basically what the oil, the onions, the whole stuff I put in there, I want to kind of get the, get the, the flavor into it. I'm going to put some water and that's done. I'm going to move on part two. I'm vandalizing my own cooking channel right here. Uh, so yeah, this is part of a, uh, Things I kind of want to do this year, I want to do a lot more uh, stupid shit because it's good for me, it's funny, it makes me feel good, it makes me feel comfortable, and it makes me feel that I don't give a fuck. Um, saying about that one is, because I'm fucking sick and tired, man, of fucking, not even living for others, just try to be our others, man. I remember somebody, I mean, I have some people texting me, or even my YouTube, texting me this and that, like, listen, motherfucker, I don't give a fuck. If you don't like my shit, off you go. And it's funny, you come to my shit to fucking tell me that you don't like it. It's like, yo, chill out. I don't know why you're here. I didn't invite you. I just push it out there. If you don't like it, tough shit. If you like it, thumbs up. Cool, carrots. I love carrots. What I'm gonna do with the carrots is, uh, Rustule, merci, cha. Somno shorshi. Vorbim, las că video ăsta nu mai are niciun de, rămâne acolo. Uh, uh, I don't know how the mic is on this one. It's on the, the, the GoPro, I know I'm down and the mic is good. But yeah. So. Oh man. Only the sound of this is perfect. Oh, and shuligan, more wine. White wine, if you don't have white wine, you can put a bit of vinegar and it gets it nice. Oh, oh. fucking love it. Now, what I'm doing this cooking channel, to, uh, I'm gonna do a lot more. Why? Because first of all, to kind of show Others that they want to cook, that you don't need much to cook, you don't have to be a chef, you don't have to do. I just open a fridge, this was my leftovers, and I'm gonna cook with them. That's not one reason, and it's fun, and I want to have fun. That's all. I'm probably because I'm lonely. No, I'm not. I could, be, I could have been fishing on my boat right now. Guess what? I'm not that lonely. Or I could have been by the heated up swimming pool I have downstairs, 
I could be at the gym I have downstairs, I could be in the jacuzzi downstairs, but now I'm here cooking, making videos. And it took me about an hour and a half to set up because that motherfucker doesn't want to start. This one took me a while to update all the software. So I'm doing something for the community. So everybody can say thank you, Chris, and fuck you, Chris. I do hope I put a smile on somebody's face somehow, somewhere. Because that's the most important thing in life, man. Make somebody else smile, you know? Make somebody else fun. Be, feel that we all belong to the same stupidity of the universe. That kind of does its own shit. So now I'm gonna put it a little bit lower. I'm gonna have some water going into that. Um, that's gonna do some stuff. And then we go to round number two, do the meat, do the potatoes, do other stuff on the side. And don't forget this is all vegan because it's funny. No, it's funny, sorry, it's fun. It's fun, you can cook anything. With meat it's easier, man. I can tell you one thing, man. With meat it's easier to cook only because the first of all I was... This is not about ignorance. We raised in a way for so long time that I've been cooking pretty much a lot of my life and uh, home cooking, I mean. And when you know the flavors, you know what to expect from that beef or how long it cooks or how long it does and then you start doing stuff with the minimum stuff and you still have to be edible or actually more likely to be not edible to be amazing and sometimes trust me or not I cook better than fucking restaurants man trust me I've been to so many restaurants I'll be like motherfucker I don't want to know that shit because he's boom Cool. Enough of this talking. I don't even know what's worse, man. I don't even know what's worse, man. Talking a lot and keep everybody entertained or me trying to talk a lot and have different subjects or different mother and without things. But everything is fun. I didn't have a smoke yet. Of course I don't have a smoke. With coffee? Oh schnapp! Does it say? Oh schnapp! Smoking time. The funny thing about uh, cooking, you can have... Uh, you can have bricks. Um, I didn't ask for it. Oh, I've got master. One second, one second. Oh, baby, baby. Yeah. Um, smoking kills. Always, everything fucking kills those days. Everything kills those days. You know what kills the most? Being unhappy, man. Being angry. Being worried. Being upset. Being always constantly aware that you need more. And that makes you fucking dead sooner than later. And if you die, may as well die happy. Bang, bang. Cool. That's done. Rule number two, I'm gonna prepare some on the side. So this is one kind of dish on its own because this is gonna be the side dish. Then I'm gonna do the uh, mushrooms, potatoes, and uh, fake meat. That's gonna be another dish. Those mushrooms are already, actually they're good, man. What am I talking about? They're not old. Uh, they are not old, they're good. I'm gonna, uh, they're gonna be forced. Okay, so those are the mushrooms right here. Now with the mushrooms, smoking mushrooms, you can't do this shit in the kitchen though, you know? That's the beauty about uh, 
bring your own chef at home, you know. You can smoke, talk, have fun, and one mushroom. I'm gonna put it in here. Alright. Man, this is power. Alright. Now that one needs water. That's the point when I put water. So already the flavors got in. Already the flavors got into the, the, the beans. So they're kind of uh, nice and steamed with flavor. Oh, fuck a fancy. Oh, mm. There you go. That much water, I think it's enough. I don't know how much it is. I can't give you the perfect amount of... Uh, what do you call it? I can't give you the perfect amount of uh, quantities because I don't, I don't cook like that. I cook by feeling. I think it's too much, but it's okay. What happens if it's too much water? Just leave it fucking steam out. Um, just a little bit, just like that. So by the time it's doing, I'm going to put it a bit higher now. So by the time it's done, it's going to steam it out and it's perfect. I'm going to cook them a la dente, a la dente, so it's going to be perfect texture. Okay, cool. That's done. More mushrooms. Go back to the basics on the second dish. It's not like a second dish, it's one dish with... Oh shit, I have the spinach. I forgot, I forgot I have the spinach too. So I'm gonna do the mushroom spinach with the fake meat. Carrots, cilantro, and, uh, and then the potatoes. I'm gonna do potatoes with... Oof, man, this is good already. I love it already. I love it already. Are we having fun? We're having fun. Put the hands up in the air and don't watch TV. Okay. Yeah, I'm not even drunk, man. I remember I done this cooking videos on YouTube. I got pretty fucked up by the end of the video. My words were like literally a chewing gum yo-yo style. And I had amazing fun, by the way. Amazing fun. You know what's funny? Actually, people commented that they love that. They love the way how organic and natural I was. Yeah, right. No, they didn't. <laughs> they didn't do that. But they're gonna have another beer talking about drinking. I'm on holiday, more friends. I'm on holiday and I fucking love it. By the way, moving from Miami to New York, sorry, from New York to Miami, was a spontaneous, uh, spontaneous, uh, spontaneous decision I had a dream and I wake up in the morning I got my flight tickets I came to see if I like Miami I stayed in different locations I went through four locations in Miami to see if, where I like it. it was South Beach was I stayed on a boat then I stayed on South Beach then I stayed on I don't know like four locations I, I stayed in a little Haiti then I stayed in a world Windward, wind, wind, windward, the graffiti area. And that reminds me of Williamsburg, I didn't want to stay there. And I said, you know what, fucking Miami Beach, it's nice, it's here. And then after, so I went back to New York after two, a week and a half, I got my ticket, I came here for a week to find a place. I find a place straight up, it was super fucking easy. I got this amazing place, it's way cheaper than New York, it has a lot of amenities. And uh, I just moved here. I haven't been in New York in a month, I still pay rent for a month because, you know, that's another story and uh, I ended up buying the boat and I ended up loving it, loving every fucking second of it. Uh, I haven't done tattoo videos because all my equipment is in New York, but I'm gonna start Next month I'm gonna start doing a lot of tattoo videos again, then I'm gonna start tattooing again. I'm gonna tattoo shit boy. It says hungover.
Ờ Ờ nè Fucking nice Let me put the fire to the Lord now In about 30 minutes, hopefully I don't cook by time either uh, when it comes to cooking, I cook by... I don't even taste it, that's another thing, probably that's a... I never taste the food while I'm cooking. I just kind of hope that it's gonna be the way I want to. And it always comes out generally pretty amazing. Celery! Yeah, let's cook that one. Let's do more. Fuck it. Anyway, that's how much celery I'm gonna cook on this. If it's too much, so what? Let me wash it, I'll be back. Let me clean this shit. Alright, so. But I do too many things at once. Drink coffee, cut the celery, smoke, stare that thing, talk, watch the channel, see if it's still recording, see who is watching. And it doesn't have any vodka in the house. I don't drink vodka anymore, man. When I was a kid, I used to drink so much. We used to get fucked up on vodka every day. We used to get a Kalashnikov vodka, that was his name. Fucking horrible stuff, man. Loving it. We used to do like hot pepper in a bottle, so shake it for about half an hour, one hour. It take the flavor off, and we get mangled. I'm talking like really mangled. We go fishing, we still got like a, like a case of vodka. So the, you could buy vodka in a case, with 20, 34 bottles of half liter of vodka. We still got one or two cases. We get fucked up. I didn't even know it was more on the water, the fish, or, or, or us, man. I didn't even know, man. I have a lot of stories to tell. Fun times, man. We used to go fishing for uh, days, for weeks, stay in the tent, catch nothing, get fucked up, come home, take a shower, eat, because we're hungry sometimes, or we just go in people's garden, take some shit, and just grill it. Fun times, fun times, I love fun times. Cool. This one I'm gonna cook it. I'm gonna cut it a little bit bigger, just like that. And why? Because this is about the size. When it comes to cooking, size matters. Yeah, girls, size matters. I I I I love when I hear the size doesn't matter. Get the fuck out, man. Size doesn't matter. Really, size doesn't matter. That's done. Oh, well, let's put some cilantro. Look what I have here. Cilantro! It's good, it's bad, it's perfect, it goes in there. Perfect, done. So that's cooking. Let me show how much water is in here. Mah, 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 mah. I don't know if you can see, but it's that much water, it's that much stuff. So by the time the water gets down enough, it's gonna be perfectly cooked. I don't know if you can see, but I can see, and that's what's important. I'm probably the best or the worst chef in the universe, but it's okay. Luckily, I didn't start cooking with weed. When the weed is gonna be legal, I don't know, I don't. Being there, done that, I'm not gonna do it again. Because I done some weed cooking once and everybody got really fucked up. And some people know about it. That was a good, that was a good, that was a good uh, party. That was a really good party. Cool, that's done there. I need carrots for that one. Now, carrots. The thing with carrots is one thing, uh, they can get, they can make the food very sweet. So, again, it's about 
when you put them to cook, when you put them like the timing, because if they get, the food can get really, really sweet. I don't like sweet food. I don't eat sweet food, so it has to be done. Has to, has to be done at the right time. And this one they're gonna be. I'm gonna put them big. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Just like that. Thank you. The other one. So all this cooking should take about. Let me cut my finger off. There you go. That's the carrot. That's prepared. It's right here. So far, so good. Let me clean this one. That's good. Let me stir on this one. Oh man. Talk about vegan food. I fucking love cooking vegan food. Well, I love cooking everything. Beer. Alright, what else? We have this, we have this, we have this. The potato is going to be cooked separately. Uh, Alright. It's that much, but actually when you cook it, it's not that much. I can put this one on the side here. The one is still on. I just turn it off. I don't even know why it's on. Because I'm the one who pays electricity. I'm going to kind of uh, rip some of them apart, the ends of it. Doesn't really matter, but I just kind of... Uh, I don't know, I remember my grandmother or my mother used to do the same thing. But usually with the old... Hold on, is this baby spinach? Usually with the older spinach you do this, so you cut the, you, you rip the ends off because it takes a little bit longer to kind of cook, whatever. So you kind of pick up the bigger ones, um, getting away all the vitamins, the vitamins. So just a little bit. I'm just kind of bored here. I'm doing it. What else? 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 So yeah, living in Miami, man, it's fantastic, man. The weather, I mean, the weather is phenomenal, man. Let me show you the. I don't know if you can see outside from here. No, I'm saying this because I have a view on the ocean. Like literally right here, I can see the boats, the ships, the cruise lines, the anything. Like the ocean is right here, and in the back I have the bay. And I just wake up in the morning, go fishing, enjoy the time, go by the pool. It's a huge fucking change compared to New York. New York, I felt New York is fucking phenomenal. Don't get me wrong, man. Don't get me wrong. New York is the best. It's the best. But when it comes to really like the lifestyle or life. Life for the soul. It's it's a lot of changes because it's one thing. Let's say right, for instance, right now in New York, it's cold. You don't do. It's a rat race, man. It takes you like forever to go from A to B. First of all, second of all, you don't have the, you know, the weather luxury. If you like good weather, I mean, or if you like sun, swimming and swimming pools and beach and whatever it is, right? I mean, New York it has different type of lifestyle. And you have different, it's, New York is all about the restaurants, museums, galleries, which is priceless. But they do have this one over here, man. The art scene over here in Miami, it's Wynwood. It's pretty big, man. They have like, I don't even know, hundreds of galleries. I don't even know. I should have to check online to see how many art galleries they have. Uh, I doubt myself. Well, I'm starting to work on some art pieces I showed you earlier. I'm going to show them again. Turn that way, Chris. 
all of a sudden. I'm working on that art piece right there. Um, only for the fact that I wanted to be productive, not just do nothing. Am I moving stuff? I don't even know. See, I'm starting moving. So, to be, to, I start doing stuff to be productive mentally. And I, this year I'm going to do a lot of that kind of large size paintings. And eventually I'm going to have an art show. That's my plan for this year. And the way I look at it, man, if you work with the universe, the law of attraction, everything happens, everything is working, everything is uh, happening if you really want to and you work for it. Talk about law of attraction. That's kind of my religion in one way, if I can call it like that, is because you work with the universe and everything is possible, but then again, I repeat, you have to fucking work with it. Law of attraction, the way it works, it's like this, right? In general, we always get whatever we want in life. I mean, it's simple like that, generally, right? So what you do is, uh, law of attraction is here, your thoughts are here, you put in and you go fastest towards the things you want. So otherwise, you're still going, but when you put a law of attraction in, in, in function, the engine of law of attraction, and you get it. But you have to work for it, man. You have to work for it. Like right now, I'm saying, I want to be in an art gallery, watch me. By the end of the year, not even, I'll give you a few months, but I need to do at least five of these things. I'm going to end up in some galleries around here. And why? Because I put my mind to it, but I'm going to work something unique, original. Uh, Stuff that I think, not like it sells because this is, this, so basically this is a universe, uh, a galaxy, that's the, like a close-up of a galaxy, on my vision of a galaxy, but it works because actually does have a lot of art scene, but young art scene, let's say New York has a very established art scene, when I'm saying that um, already artists, they have a name, they have this. Over here it seems that being graffiti is very huge, like Wynwood, if you check it out on the internet. Graffiti is very huge, so it's more, the way I look at it, this is my opinion on it. It's more like, a, it's more like, a, it's, it's more like, a, what do you call that? It's more like a younger stuff. So you have younger, more colorful, more, more today stuff. In New York, I generally, I mean, the, as far as I've been to archives and stuff, you have more contemporary, more, I don't know, man, more, I don't, I don't even know what to say. Like, I had been some artists and people fucking die for it, like, motherfucker, that artist was drunk, like a motherfucker, and probably put that paintbrush in his dick and he's done three lines and it's $70,000. And you idiot is gonna buy it. If you have the money, buy it, because you know what? People don't realize it's an investment in tax free. You don't pay tax, you buy a painting. That's how it is. If you have to pay tax a million dollars, you buy a and paintings and you're done. Percent. I don't know how much is here, how it works, but I will find out. When I find out, I'm gonna let everybody know. I'm gonna make a video about it. So far, nobody's watching on Facebook. Amazing. Everybody got sick and tired of me talking. On YouTube, I have three people, and that's even more impressive. What matters is that actually somebody can enjoy it, and what matters is that I do enjoy myself. Because then we have done this shit regardless and um, not be that funny. Ha ha ha. Oh man. Oof. Cool, that's done, that's done, that's done, that's done, that's done. The spinach is done. Kind of, hold on, let me get some stuff out of it. There you go, I still have. So what I did, I just cleaned the ends of it. I don't know, I think this is, the, 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 the thing with this, it takes longer to cook, that's all, that's why I do it. And I, I want to have everything the same texture, I'll say. This is going to be only satay, it's very fast. Uh, the main point is going to be... Hold on, what's the fake meat? This one. Beyond meat, it's beef crumbled fisty. So this is like a beef crumbled, beef crumbled... Um, I don't know. We'll see. Salutor, Chichi in Los Angeles. Salutor, people. Salutor, salutor, salutor. So I have people texting me from different locations of the world, man. From Ireland, Romania, LA so far. I think it was a good 
do actually say hello, not just fuck you. It's amazing. It's appreciable and thank you all of you. Hat off! I'm getting gray by the way, I'm getting gray man. Don't put your head on the food, Chris. Be a real chef. Be a real chef. Okay, that's done. This is done too. Let me put that one even lower down and start now. Cooking nice and slow. Perfect. Alright, that's done. What else do I have here? What else do I have here? I have a tomato. A lonely half tomato. A lonely half tomato. And that's cool. Lonely half tomato is not bad. It's better than uh, two lonely tomatoes. More. I'm, I'm posting this video for the last three hours of uploading, man. The vlog I done yesterday. Talking about vlogging, I think I said earlier, I'm trying to, I'm trying to do vlogs at least, I'm trying, well, I mean, it's kind of, I'm talking shit, but I do want to do one a day to post up, and um, the reason is because I do want to have uh, something about my life, talking about vlogging, uh, I want to do something to look back and have it, it's my life, you know, when I look back, probably my kids going to look for myself, you know, it's not selfish, it's not, I mean, don't get me wrong, I want to make money out of it. But, you know what, fuck it man, fuck it, fuck it man, I want to do something for myself and this is the year, I started last year actually, I started doing a lot more stuff for myself, um, it feels good, it feels good that you can do whatever the fuck you want and nobody can say anything, bang, 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 cool, let me put this one a little bit more further away, I think it's like this, because one of the, it looks like a, Press down the tomatoes here, let's put them right there. I think they go together at the same time. I mean, I should have cleaned this shit up. Ah, that doesn't matter. Cool. So that's another one done. The mushrooms are done here. I put them right here. I'm gonna get this fry pan. Oh man, this is good. This is good. Good boys and girls, this is good. Oh man, oh man. Can anybody see? This is phenomenal. I, I haven't tasted that man, I will when it's done. I think that's a problem I have with my cooking. I don't, I don't test it, but it's okay. We're gonna. We're gonna survive, we're gonna survive, we're gonna survive without testing it. Uh, what am I doing? Hold on a second. The meat, I need the meat and I need the potatoes. I have the vegetables here. Let's see what's about this meat. Let's see what's about this meat, this meat, this meat, this meat. This, this meat is... So this company has some burger from them. They were on point. There you go. Oh, oh! It smells good actually, it smells good. Flavor wise, I cooked something the other day, it wasn't the best, it's kind of a force. Now sir, Tony! Jesus Christ! I can't answer Tony, okay. That's still a bit frozen, but okay. Cool. Talking about this one, we need we need uh, we need more onion. half onion on this one um, why because I think one is too much it's not that much here I don't want to overemphasize the flavor and after that everything is golden man everything is golden yesterday I cooked 
was yesterday or day before? The day before yesterday, man. I cooked some nice chicken. I grilled some chicken on the boat. I have a barbecue there. It's fucking heaven, man. Heaven. This is this one. I'm gonna make it small. How you do it small? Can everybody see how this one works? You cut it like this. Then you just do like. See? That one I do it like that only because I want to make sure it melts. I don't want any onion. Uh, I say something. I, I don't want any onion uh, onion present. Or at least body present in the food. I just want that kind of a flavor. So this is gonna melt. This one and the garlic from this one. They go at the same time. They There you go. So that's done. This is the first round that goes in the fry pan. Uh, what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna move this one here, this one there, because we can. Cool. Here we go. Thank you. Now it's cooking. We come here. Fire higher. Oh, this is so good. The order of this, we go with them to get the flavor out. Then we go with these bad boys. We go with these bad boys. Then we put the meat, and then we're gonna put the spinach. And pretty much that's how it's done. But until then, we're gonna use some uh, beer. Yeah. Loving it. Loving it. Loving it. What else? What else is cooking? What else is cooking? Not much, man. No much. I think I talked a lot about it. Uh... <sighs> Shit, yeah. What else? Oh, I'm gonna, when I go on a, this trip is gonna take about, I think we, so we post it, I'm gonna keep everybody posted and I'm gonna make something cool out of it. As I said, this year I wanna have a lot of fun. Yeah, last year I had a lot of fun. I worked my fucking ass off, so that's luckily, I did that too. But this year I wanna actually have a lot of, lot of, lot of fun. And I'm gonna try to work less but focus more on artistic side. Now, when I said that is because this place is living in Miami is a lot cheaper. I'm not gonna make the same money like in New York, but I will actually try to minimize the expenses. I have everything I need. I just gonna kind of focus on because I can. That's why somebody's asking. Okay, perfect. Done. Alright, there you go, I said it, same chef, same hot and spicy garlic, I use this because, I don't know, I just got it by this first time I got this thing, but I love it man, I love it, the whole thing, but it's nothing left. Uh, I'm gonna put some little bit more olive oil, right here. It's not much actually, if you look at the oil, it's not much. How much oil? There you go. It's, uh, just, oh, oh, oh. it's just a little bit of oil. So it's not a lot of oil, by the way. They say oil or whatever is not healthy. I know, I know, I feel guilty about it. That's done, that's done, that's done. We have one people watching on YouTube. Say hello to my little friend. And uh, nobody on Facebook. Fucking. Brilliant. Now I love it because I... Actually, what am I talking? Hold on a second. Hold on. When I say one, one, one people watching on YouTube, the stupidest thing, this thing a while back, I done the same thing, a video, and I was watching myself. And I was kind of talking to that person, kind of, oh, respect that you keep watching me, whatever. No, motherfucker, that was me. And it's funny. Now, what happened after is actually people came in and started watching after, so... I think that was funny. So it's, the situation is here now, the same thing, the same situation. Uh, again, I repeat, I'm cooking 
with myself, for myself, so it doesn't fucking matter. But it's funny how we get to this point. Cool. We put this stuff in there. Ooh. I do. Ooh. Now we tap. I like it. I like it. That's cool. Um, what else? What else, Chris? Tell the people something else. Tell the people who's not watching something else. Say hello to my little beer. Probably that's why it is. Mm. The other day I tried to do a live video from uh, the boat, and obviously being with a GoPro on Facebook, but because it's attached to the internet to my phone, it was very, very bad. So I do apologize for not. Oh man. The sound. One thing I love about cooking is the sound, man. When, when you say when everything is frying, like, boof, so fucking good, so fucking good, so fucking good. Ah, uh, check this shit. My window's fucking turbo wide open. Do I have? Both of you guys, both of you cameras. Let me show you something else here. Whoa, whoa. While I'm doing. how it looks isn't that fucking amazing isn't that fucking amazing one out of the way it's hard to do two chance at once man wow. now we got what we're looking for so that's my view man and um, right now I'm on shorts and um, and uh, shorts and something else. And uh, the beauty about it is, it's fucking summer. And your camera, Chris, is all over the place. Are we back on the same spot? We're back on the same fucking spot, Muffles. Hold on, let me pull that thing back. That was about there. Uh, all right. Cool. Oh, shit, that's burning. That's burning. It's not burning. That's not burning. When this one gets golden, man. This is, you know, it's fucking done. Again, the same thing, the same situation here. We're gonna go with a little bit of a, with a little bit of a, that camera has to go a little bit more back. I do apologize, people. With a little bit, oh, hold on a second. How am I? Where am I? Where am I? Cool, perfect. So this is more, I need this one. Oh, salt. Backward. Fucking Texas, man. Fucking robot calls, man. Robot calls. Paprika. Let it get a little bit more goldy and we start. Man, all these robot calls, man. That's another fucking theory I have, right? You pay all this money to a, to a, to a, to a, to a phone company and they fucking sell you the, the, the thing to robot calls, man. And I have, I'm asking like five times a day. And they all ask me, do you want to get insurance? Do you want to like, motherfucker, you're a robot, motherfucker. Yes, yes, no, uh, whatever. Okay, cool. Now, this is golden. This is golden. This is golden. This is golden. Cool. So that's done. Now, that one, oh man, we do this. That was good, that was good, boy, that was good. And you know what? Fuck it. I'm gonna put a meat too. I don't let that one get the flavor, the same thing like the other one. I just gonna start. Oh shit, actually no. Nobody's watching me on YouTube. So that means somebody is watching. Schnapp. 
Oh, there's one people watching me all the time. I do apologize that it didn't happen the way we wanted to. Uh, nobody's watching on Facebook. Bang, bang, Chris, you are a fucking ninja. I love it, I love it, I love it, I love it. Because that means I don't please nobody the way they want, the way they want, because this is fun. Oh, bang it, that was up, right there, perfect, good, that's done. Later on we have the mushrooms. That's the cooking, man. That's the, oh, why wine? It's okay, we have more in the glass. We have more in the glass. Perfect. Now we're doing business. All right. So that's done. That's done. Pretty much. This is gonna. Oh shit. Let me check on this. Oh man. Let me put some salt on this. I can fuck it up. Put a little bit salt in here. Put a bit of this. So when it comes to salt, you can put as much as you think is good. And I'm gonna put some again, garlic and onion, because I love it. Pepper, a lot of pepper. It's not that much. The holes are very tiny. All right, that's done. higher because it's important. Those are done out of the way. I got the potatoes. Potatoes are pretty simple to do. They're gonna be on its own as a side dish. And I have these little small bad boys. I wait for a week and all the shit I have in the fridge I don't want them to go bad and I was like you know what please do it all at once. So I'm gonna take the food with us in the car and yeah I'm gonna eat it by the time we go because I don't know how we're gonna heat it up. We will heat it up. In a hotel room somewhere. I don't even know in the car. I don't have any. Let me wash them, let me wash them. Those are washed, what I do with them, pretty fucking simple. Just cut them in half, man. Cut them in half, that's what I do with them. Why? Because you think cutting, uh, it's easier to cook. I mean, obviously, if it's full. But it's easier to eat them, I'll say. It's easier to actually grab them and eat them than just like a big potato. Now, if I'll be... Well, I have, okay, I have this idea of a, I have this idea of a restaurant, I want to open a restaurant eventually, if somebody wants to invest, in Miami here, I'm going to open a restaurant when I cook only one dish a day, and pretty much something like this, and that's what you fucking get, the only one thing is going to be, of course, cooking a lot, and when it's done, it's done, you're out, and that's it, and green juices, because I have that, uh, I'm part of that green juice company, I'm the creative director of a green juice company, and I have percentages of that company, and it's going to be like a green juice bar with one type of meal a day. And that meal is going to be a luxury thing, when I say luxury, not price-wise, it's going to be cheap, but it's going to be only one dish, so I want to cook it myself. When I finish work, I go there, fucking prepare all the chef cooking tomorrow, next day in the morning, bang, 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 bang. So I cook it like very slow overnight. Just cook like huge pots and serve people. People that work in constructions, people that do this. Uh, because vegan, so the juice that I have are vegetarian and vegan. Uh, because that one is a thing, I'm gonna meat. 
That's one of my dreams. And it's going to happen because that's what I told you earlier. Love attraction works like that. Time for another smoke because I can. Cool. So, that's cooking. I forgot I still have the spinach and the... You know what? I don't want to cook the spinach separately. Fuck, let's do this. I'm gonna cook it in here so everybody can see what I'm doing. It's a small pot. Alright. Oh, I'm gonna have four dishes. So basically, I'm gonna cook the. The potatoes. Um, this. The potatoes are gonna be cooked on this. The. No, this is I'm gonna cook the potatoes on this. I'm gonna put the spinach in this. We have a uh, fake meat, beef meat with uh, carrot, celery, onion, and garlic. And over here we have uh, green peas with carrot, onion, and garlic. Because that's the only one shot I have on the fridge, and I have to cook everything. Cooking. All right, the potato is gonna be here. Okay, no, sorry, the that one is gonna be here. What I do with this stuff, the same thing. That oil is done. I'm gonna use normal oil. Not too much, just a little bit. Why? Because. Okay, I don't have any more garlic, but I have onion. And I'm gonna put only a little bit on this. Now, when it comes to onion and garlic, it's part of my routine. I don't know why, probably I grew up with that stuff. But it just gives that kind of nice start of a... You can burn it a little bit and it gives that kind of nice smoky burning uh, flavor. Spanish is uh, un punto. Beer number two, gone. Now in that one, in that one, I'm gonna put the, so on the meat one, I'm gonna put the stock vegetables. I wanna, I'm not gonna use water. That's the charger because those cameras they don't last long. That's charging. Perfect. So so far it's phenomenal. Hope everybody loves my stuff. Yeah Chris, you did good bro, you did good, you did amazing today. I need another beer. This time we're gonna go with tomato. 
Čelada, I fucking love Čelada, znam. Who loves me Čelada? I love me Čelada. This is a Čelada, I don't know what this I couldn't get enough of that shit. The way they do it in Mexico, have you seen this shit? Shrimps, bacon. Forget about it, man. The biggest, the nicest, the best shit in the world. Uh huh. Mushrooms. And tomatoes. You know the half lonely tomato I told you about? It goes right now with the mushrooms. And then goes the spinach on top, and voila. And then we do the fries. And pretty much, man, that's how we fucking cook, man. Four fucking. Four dishes, one idiot, moi, a lot of beers, coffee, cigarettes, and whatever is in the fridge. If somebody wants me to cook something, and I can actually go and do a special cooking for whatever wants to, if they want to have a special flavor. So this is all vegan, by the way. This is all fucking vegan. Um, there you go. This is a vegan meal today. On YouTube, I don't, uh, I don't like Romanian uh, cabbage. I don't uh, potatoes. This is my first vegan life food cooking, and it's gonna be phenomenal. Mm -hmm. I can't play music in the background, man. First of all, as, as I, I repeated earlier, first of all, the YouTube, they are going to be, uh, fuck you, Chris, we're going to monetize. You, we're going to get and give everything you work for to somebody else. And second of all, I think, ah, oh, fuck it, I can do without it. There's sometimes, <laughs> talking about music, man, I like that silence sometimes. Actually, very rarely I play music. It's, I just like to be in my own silence head, you know? It's not silent, it's fucking loud. My head is loud as fuck. But yeah. Or should I have this one? This one? This one. It's looking oh, phenomenal, phenomenal. Oh man. It's cooking. Actually, that's nearly done, by the way. This one is cooking. This is nice and colorful. It's cooking. I'm telling you, this is cooking. I'm gonna push it that way. All right, it's cooking. Let me put the fire to less. I got this one. I wanna like slow cook, so I'm gonna put it on two right now. The other one is on this one. The mushrooms is on five, I could go on four. And uh, I'm gonna put the potatoes soon, so everything is gonna be. Oh! The way I cook, everything is gonna be done at the same time. Not that I have a fucking time frame here, but I just wanna show you guys how easy it is to cook four types of food and finish them at the same time, it's all about timing. Bang, 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 bang. I'm talking a lot of shit. And a lot, when I say a lot of shit, a lot of shit. Because I've been talking for the last, I don't even know how long my videos is, but I've been talking a lot, man. I've been talking a lot, and i kind of ruining all of ideas, and I'm gonna start repeating myself. Oh, I'm getting tipsy. It's all good, it's all good. That's the part when, Cool, that's done. Smoking is out of the way. Now the potatoes, the potatoes, the potatoes, I'm gonna put on top right now. I'm gonna go with salt on top. I'm gonna prepare them a little bit. Alright. Pepper, 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 pepper. A lot of pepper. Mix them 
I don't have anything else, man. You know what? Fuck it. Let's go this way. Oh. I'm gonna use with potatoes, I'm gonna use turmeric. Turmeric? Turmeric, 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 turmeric. Oh. That's the turmeric right there. Golden fingers. Let me wash it. Let me wash it. Let me clean myself. That yellow stuff, man. Cool, so that's all done here for now. I don't think so I need this one yet. I'm done with that for now. Let me put this one here. Let me stir a little bit. Cool. Uh, that's pretty much nearly done. What I'm gonna do right now with that one is I just wanna kind of the water. That's why I took the thing off, the lid off. I want the water to just. I wanna have them like. Uh, Sate, basically, so it's not, uh, I don't want any, any water left. The same thing with this one. I'm not making a stew, so I want them to just be... Now, those beans, they are not al dente anymore. I like when I say I'm going to do al dente. That's why I don't taste it. I taste it, it's good, and it's salt and pepper, and we're done. Pretty much is cooked, but I want to just kind of make the water down. Down is nearly done. This one is getting goldy, getting goldy, getting goldy. The mushrooms are getting goldy. I need to put a fire higher. I want to just fry them, and then I'm going to put spinach on and potatoes on with that. Fuck the beer is over there. Cool. You guys being uh, two people on YouTube. Say hello to pe two people on YouTube. This is here. All right. Let's put the oil on. So this one is gonna go right here. I'm gonna turn it high. I got the potatoes. Down in is the spinach in this one. So far it's looking like this. That's the mushrooms with the tomato. That's on two, if I... Alright. Bro, bro. Cool, that's done. That's done. The potatoes is coming here. And... Man, I didn't take a tire break. I didn't do... I'm holding it though. I'm holding pretty good. The beer is good though. I still have coffee. I didn't even finish that coffee. But uh, I might. I might not. What else? The weather is fucking beautiful, man. It's beautiful. It's amazing. But getting out of the water, I'm like... Eh. Too cold. Uh, I don't want that. I don't like cold, man. I don't fucking like cold. I couldn't stand it, man. I can't stand it. That's why that, that was the reason when I moved from uh, New York, actually, I got uh, winter depressed. 
I'm gonna say winter press is I do get seasonal press, I think. And I uh, had to kind of uh, leave, you know? I had to leave, man. Cool, the mushrooms are goldy, kind of. But it's good enough. Now with the tomato, what I'm doing is, with the tomato, Bringing the skin up. So the skin is out. It's nothing wrong with that. I have a bad joke with the tomato skin, but I'm not gonna tell it. So, somebody told me a story about it, uh, this, this cut thing, and I'm not gonna, I, I'm not gonna, I talked a lot of shit, but this one is not going on, um, it's not going on this topic, right? Mihai, merci mult, merci, 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 merci Mihai, uh, that's my Romanian uh, people, they watch. Ah, oh, my friends. I won't have any Spanish because I could say muchas gracias. Me alegro mucho de ser... Um, no. No, I don't even know what to say on that one. My Spanish is good, but not that good. All right. The mushrooms, they are uh, on a state of good mind. Oh, snap! This one is here! Potato, 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 I still don't feel the I still don't feel the tom the, the mushrooms and tomato because then down it goes the spinach. I don't feel it yet, so it's not golden enough. As I said earlier, everything has to be done at the right time. I'll be back on one second. Now I do have to go. Yep, I wash my hands, they're wet, so please don't say that I did something I didn't do. Ooh, this is cooking perfect, that's perfect timing, that's perfect timing. And that's perfect. Now, now on. Oh, bro, bro, bro. Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Oof. Thank you. So, on down we have uh, this one is uh, the golden part, is the turmeric with salt, pepper. I want to kind of steam inside and then towards the end I just push it, I, I just let it breathe and I just make a nice crust so they're going to be inside, they're going to be soft but it's super crusty outside. This is phenomenal, now the mushrooms are good. When I'm saying the mushrooms are good, you have to, I don't know if you can see much, but it's a gold crust on it. That's when they're done. I know it looks like a lot, 
but the spinach is gonna leave it's gonna basically the spinach is gonna get only that much and I'm gonna twist it a little bit in here there's the spinach pot now and there you go voila Four motherfucking dishes, four motherfucking dishes, moi, and whatever is in the fridge, and it's all vegan. Not vegetarian, vegan. I learned that it's a difference between vegetarian and vegan. Um, it's not the ignorance, it's the fact that I don't, uh, I don't care about it, I would say. And so basically, vegan, let me guess if I'm guessing right. Vegan is anything to do with animals, anything dairy free, anything whatever. I'm ve vegetarian. You can actually have eggs, fish, honey. Uh, so pretty much. So this one is all none of them free. So there's no animal touch the area. Is that okay? Done. Let me this one right here. I need this one right here. But this is how it is, man. This is how it is. So I learned it and uh, that's what I'm doing. And I'm proud of myself that I actually this is not my first vegan dish. I, I've been cooking vegan for a while now, once in a blue moon. I still like my fucking chicken, my beef, my little piggy, my bacon, my eggs. Fucking love it. Love it, love it, love it. Uh, you see, what did I told you? Look, how, look how, how, how it went down, right? You see how much was earlier? And then it's a lot of... Uh, yeah. So this one is just gonna saute, uh, pretty much that's it. I can put this one... Uh, this is on fire, it's good. Cool. So when I say that, my whole opinion about being a vegetarian and people eating meat, and that's my personal opinion, I don't want nobody offended because again, I feel like people get really fucking offended for no reason. When it comes to vegetarians and vegans, they feel sometimes I met people, they preach, I'm like, yo, motherfucker, please, give me a fucking break. Oh, oh, please, you people eat animals, like, yo, two weeks ago you were eating animals, oh, a year ago you were eating animals, ten years ago. You just become like that. It's like you find the wrong God. Don't fucking preach it. Don't shovel your fucking religion on somebody's mouth. Let them be if they want to be. That's my own opinion. And I have a lot of friends, they're vegan, vegetarians, and the people I hang out with, they don't, when I'm talking about vegan, vegetarians, they are not like that. I hate when people try to preach or make you feel guilty or they feel, they feel bigger than you. Vegan, I'm proud. I was like, yo, come on. I believe in God and I'm proud. I was like, Cut it off, cut it off, cut it off. And you know what? This is not this is not to talk shit about nothing or nobody. But it's something you find on your own self. You can't suddenly put people down, right? That's the way I look at it. I don't give a fuck what I eat. I mean, I care, but in a way that I enjoy. I'm not gonna buy 10 kilos of meat only because I have the money. I have, I buy a like little chicken and I eat it, right? So I'm still sensible. But now, when you try to save the planet and leave the animals alone, it's like, oh, really? What are you gonna do with them? So you can't kill them. They're gonna take over. So what are you gonna do with all this shit? How about if you live in Siberia? Do you really think you're gonna wake up in the morning? First of all, you don't have any vegetables. You don't here. But you think you wake up in the morning and start working your ground or whatever the fuck you do there with salad, motherfucker? Get the fuck out of my face, man. See, that's the fucking problem. That's the ignorance comes in. Only because you have an office work and you have money to buy stuff on whole food shit. Not everybody can that. Do you think somebody has seven kids and one job? Do you think that motherfucker can vegan their kids up? Get the fuck out, man. See, that's my problem with all these preachers. If you do something, do it your own way. Because that's the way to do it. You do it for yourself. You don't do it to, to save the world. Because guess what? If like tomorrow something happens, everything is contaminated and you can eat only meat, you will survive. You wouldn't be like, oh, I love meat. That fucking right you love me to survive, motherfucker. That's exactly. People eat their own... I don't know if you know the story. This is morbid, but... 
but in the second world, people will exchange, like in the, in the winter, will exchange their dead babies to to survive. Like if my baby dies, I, lead, I exchange with your baby, so to eat it to survive. That's a real story. That's a fucking history. Now tell, tell those motherfuckers being vegan is wrong. Or it's, it's the best thing. Like, motherfucker, I need to fucking survive. Otherwise, my fucking five kids die. Now that's the shit which it really doesn't obsess me or put me in a place where I don't understand why you have to fucking preach your shit. Do it. You can say, listen, you want to taste my vegan stuff? Yeah, I do it. And I love it. I fucking love it. I love it. And my friends know that. They come in there. I fucking love it. I've been to vegan festivals. I went to a vegetarian vegan uh, juice company. I believe in that. But I don't believe when you fucking preach and shovel in somebody's throat. That's I don't fucking like it. Talking about that stuff is, that's how it is. And that's my opinion. And it's not to offend anybody because you know what? Again, people get offended. I'm vegan, I'm proud. Guess what? I don't give a fuck. I eat, I eat meat and I'm proud. And I need to survive. But anyway, this meat is vegan, by the way. Not vegetarian. Vegan! Oof. Oh, man. Oh, man. Look at these golden little fishes. Oh, yeah. Fucking amazing. That's fucking amazing. That's fucking amazing. Hold on. My phone is dying. I need charging. I'll be back in one second. Come here, little boot. Alright. Where it is? Sorry guys, one second. All right, back to normal. One little robot was dying on the spot right here, so I had to fix the situation. Cool. It's kind of hard with, to deal with four dishes at one time, man. It's kind of hard. But if I can do it, you can do it. If I can do it, you can do it. I got it, man. Doesn't have much flavor, man. It's fake, but... It, so this company makes these burgers, they are insanely amazing. But this one, for a reason, it tastes like cardboard and water. What it needs, it needs something else, man. Something is really fucking spicy. Look how beautiful this one looks. Seasoned. Seasoned looks amazing. Cool. That's actually really done. They're all... As I said, the way I cook, everything is done at the same time. <clears throat> it's going to be finished at the same time. Oof, that's spicy. I don't know which one is spicy, but I don't care. Because I love it. This is how I like it. Oh man. This is how you got your fucking place on fire. Mm -hmm.
आणि तुला जर लिहिद सीवन गॅस घेत होता वातोड तिला जर लिहिद इज दॉन दस लिहिद दस दॉन अक्षर नॉन लेमी पुष दाव मोड अनम दाव मॅन on i am nearly down let me take this one now we go down i need to make sure it's goldy down it's cooking nice this one the same thing out so right now what i'm doing is i try to let them steam out and we have perfect combo of food right here Done. They're all done. They're all done. This one. Oh man. This one. I never had. Uh, they were gold as fuck. I never had potatoes with turmeric. 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 Whatever it is. But I do have now. And uh, here we are. It was this enjoyable or not? Mm. Uh, it was for me because I had motherfucking fun, a lot of fun. I still have the tomato sauce right there. I should have. I may have. Uh, I don't know, man. Probably goes on that one. Mm -mm, mm -mm. Maybe, maybe not. No, it's good. We don't need tomato sauce now. Cool. Oh man, phenomenal. Fucking phenomenal. Now let me clean up the space here and I show you what I done. I show what I done. I'm pretty much that's it. I still have beer. potatoes in general because of the oil I do this I do this then I got my spatula I got this one out Look how fucking beautiful those are cooked. Can everybody see it? Hold on, where am I? Where am I? Where is my video? Ma. Yes. Nice, 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 nice. Good. That one. Let me get another one for that one. And I put just a little bit 
little bit of fresh salt, fresh pepper, I'm looking for cilantro, cilantro, cilantro. I have the cilantro here, I'm gonna cut it in pieces. There you go. Oof. Mama. So this is the potatoes right here. Fucking golden. This is the potatoes right here. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. I said thank you, sir. This is the spinach. This is this. This is this. I'm gonna put a small dish to show you how it's fucking prepared. And um, we done. And thank you. And I really appreciate for watching me. If you did, if not, I did it for myself because I would have cooked it anyway, and I would have got even more drunk. Actually, I would have got drunk. So let's pretend that I eat. Oh baby, 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 baby. This is how we cook it. This is how we cook it. This is how we cook it. Let me show you how it's served. Mm-hmm. Thank you, thank you, thank you, I appreciate it. Bang! Four dishes in one. Now, it's easy to talk shit, but Have one. Oven. Have one. I need a fork. I'm talking, man. Being big or not. Nice. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. And a piece. Oh, man. The best dish in the, in the universe. Now, I don't have a recipe for this, so I can't give you any motherfucking recipes. But all this shit is pretty much healthy, heaven, amazing, and super beautiful. Thank you very much for watching with me, both of you cameras, YouTube and Facebook, Facebook and YouTube. And see you next time. If you really like it, leave a comment. And if you really like a dish, vegan, vegetarian, meat, whatever the fuck it is, I'll cook it. If I if not, I'm gonna have fun cooking it regardless. If I don't succeed. Oh man, this is fucking heaven. This is really motherfucking good. That's what I'm talking about. Really motherfucking good. And I hope you really enjoy it, man. And uh, me talking about all the stuff is because that's how it is. I'm not here to impress anyone, I'm not here to impress Nobody, I'm not here to fucking give a fuck about most of you motherfuckers things because you know what? I have fun. Bye. Have a nice and beautiful evening, day, whatever the fuck it is, weekend, week, I don't even know what day it is. But, um, cheers with the homies. Three beers. And four dishes, that's my boy right here, that's my boy, well done Chris, well done, thank you, bye, goodbye and thank you.